Boys and girls, welcome back. It is another edition of the Southern Soccer Idiot. Thank you so much for joining us. Happy Monday morning, the day after Christmas. It is Boxing Day. And even though the World Cup has been over for a little more than a week now, we are going to be jumping back into club soccer, uh, especially hot and heavy in England today. I'm filming this super early in the morning before Brenton, uh, Brentford and Tottenham kick off at 6 o'clock uh, Central Standard Time here in Alabama, USA. And then the 9 o'clock games are going to be Everton versus Wolves, Palace versus Fulham, Leicester versus Newcastle, Southampton versus Brighton. The 11.30 game, we'll see my boys Liverpool on the road at Aston Villa. And then at 2 p.m. will be Arsenal versus West Ham. Now, those might not be exciting as France and Argentina, but let me tell you what, I love each and every one of those matchups. I absolutely just love the Premier League. I just love club soccer in general. Just about any big, uh, big five European league game, it, to me, is worth a watch, uh, even if it's a couple uh, relegation battling teams. But for now, we got just a little bit of unfinished business. This will be the last two blaster boxes that I have on hand. This will be blaster box number 9 and 10 of the FIFA World Cup Qatar 2022 Panini Prism Box Break Extravaganza. Overall, between the previous eight blaster boxes, the three breakaway boxes, and the one choice box, I'd say we did okay. Not bad. Nowhere near as, as, as good as I would liked. Did not really have any super spectacular bangers, I would say. But we did okay. From a collecting standpoint, we did all right. From a, uh, you know, posting on Instagram, posing with cards standpoint, we didn't do so great. But we're not on Instagram. We're not on any of that other stuff. What you're seeing here on YouTube is exclusive content boys and girls if you did not realize that maybe one day i'll expand out into other formats but uh what we're doing right here on youtube right here and now is the only way to see what the southern soccer idiot is up to so without further delay we're going to jump right into these two blaster boxes let's hope for some end of the road luck Let's hope we got something super special to put in those uh, card holders there. A trusty knife. Go ahead and open that one up. Just set it back over there. I'm going to go ahead and open this one up just to go ahead and get it out of the way. And we will go ahead and kick off the party with the box on the right. As you know already, four cards per uh, six packs. We will be hoping for the best as always. I don't know if these are anti-theft devices or what, but sometimes I've seen people, or these fall out of uh, boxes and there'd be bangers in there, and, but that has not happened to me yet. But let's hope it does right here and now. So, Blaster box number one. Let's get it started. Thank you all for again for joining us each and every time you have been with us. Got an Eric Garcia base, Declan Rice, Brendan Aronson, and oh, we got a pink. We got a pink. Let's see, is that number? That is numbered. I can feel on the back the numbering there. The pink is going to be Ao Tanaka of japan let's go ahead and turn that light off get the glare down a little bit ao tanaka of japan that is a purple not a pink a purple 54 of 99 not too terribly a little bit off center just a bit but a good looking car that's a really pretty card i have not uh oh sorry ao i have not pulled up purple yet so that is my first purple get the base cards out of the way hopefully that's a good sign of even bigger and better things to come. Uh, Safarovic of Switzerland, Casemiro of Brazil, Yota of Portugal, who unfortunately did not play. Hopefully he's healthy to get back with Liverpool soon. And a Wales team card. Wales, of course, not, of course, not making it even out of the group. 
with um, the US, England, and Iran. See, oh, that's our, oh, our green wave for Ricardo Pepe, who of course did not even play on the team in the World Cup. Casper Dolberg, uh, Baron Von from Iran, and our first green prism is going to be a rookie. Is that Gakpo? Is that Gakpo? That is not. That is Jeremy Pina. My man Jeremy Pina from uh, Spain and from Villarreal. That's a pretty, pretty good looking card in general, to tell you the truth. Y'all know that I'm a uh, pretty big Jeremy Pina fan. Uh, of course, I, a couple episodes back when I shared with y'all some of the uh, um, recent online buys and um, card show buys, I had several Jeremy Pina cards. I think he is going to be a heck of a player for uh, Spain and for Villarreal. Still, on, whoa, 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 whoa. I knocked the, uh, knocked the camera over there. There it goes, live bloopers. Everybody's going to have a laugh about that. Everybody's going to have a laugh about that, and that's okay. Let's get everything set back up here. Well, that's a little embarrassing, but, you know, hey, life's a little embarrassing sometimes, and what do you do? You just roll with the punches. But Eduardo Mendy. Arthur Thiet of uh, Belgium, Coop Myers of the Netherlands, and a scores club for Louis Suarez. Sorry once again about the uh, camera fail there. Sorry about that. But hey, you get to see all the good, the bad, and the ugly here on this channel. Contreras of Costa Rica, Lovakovic of Croatia, Kimpembe of uh, France and a green prism for Marquinhos. Nice color match there for the Brazilian. Good looking card there. That is a good looking card. Last pack. Hasn't been a bad little box. Got that purple there. Nothing big going to be in this one. It doesn't look like. Going to have a connections card to finish it out. Uh, Baba of Ghana. Luis of France, Flores of Mexico, and a connections card for the Hernandez brothers of France. Put that right there. Move Marquinhos down there. We'll put Theo and Lucas right there. And we will jump right on into box number two. Halfway through the break. It has been a lot of fun. Thanks to each and every one of you who have joined in the viewing pleasure. I've had some fun with us along the way. Commenting, liking, subscribing. Thanks to each and every one of you for the support. Okay, we got a Pedri base. Uh, Ugbo of Canada. Uh, Kim of the, uh, South Korea, the Korea Republic. Of course, we pulled that uh, really good-looking pink card of his. And then a green prism for Alexander Mitrovic of Serbia. And Fulham, who has, who's actually playing quite well for Fulham this year. And he scored something like 43. There's another one of those things. 43 goals in the championship, which uh, some of you may not know is the second division in England. Like 43 goals in the championship last year. That is just incredible. Absolutely incredible. Uh, not sure how many he's got this year uh, for Fulham, but I believe he's close to double digits. But uh, carrying on, Noah Okafor of Switzerland, Bellingham of uh, England, Ronaldo Sanchez of Portugal and a connections card for uh, Brazil, Alexandro and Danilo, the uh, right and left back for Brazil. Yunus Musa of the United States, Philip Coutinho of Brazil. Osmoon of Iran and a green prism refractor rookie for Luka Sucic of Croatia. Halfway through, 
The last box. Is that card backwards? No, that card is not backwards. Uh, Christian Pulisic of the U.S., Polson of Denmark, Kozlowski of Poland, and a New Era card for Jules Koundé of France. Very talented right back. Two packs to go. Looks like we got some good looking uh, color again. We'll have another purple it looks like. Amrabat of Morocco, Mila Boyan of Canada, Joshua Kimmich of Germany, and will this purple be a rookie? It is. It's going to be a rookie. Who we got? Josip Stanic of Croatia. Josip Stanic of Croatia. Who do I pull down here? I guess this number to what, 39, is that correct? Uh, 99, 26 of 99, Joseph Stanich. Forgive me, Yerman, I'm going to put you down here with the rest of the little green men. So we're going to end up with one pink and one purple. They are, or they're both purple, they're both numbered to 99. They're both numbered to 99, they are both numbered to 99. So I guess those are purple. They look just a bit different, but hey, two sharp cards, uh, good color for to come from a blaster. All right, last pack of the blaster box. Martin Boyle, Raheem Sterling. Oh, let's put him over there. Uh, Tuna of Mexico, and our last card is going to be a global reach for Ter Stegen of Germany. So that is it, boys and girls. That was our last two blaster boxes of the uh, Panini Prism Box Break Extravaganza. Got a nice little scores club for Suarez, a couple connections card for France and Brazil. New Era Jules Kunde, Global Reach for Ter Stegen. Uh, two nice rookies in the uh, green prisms, aqua green prisms for uh, Spain and Croatia, Pino and Sukic, uh, uh, Serbian Mitrovic and Marquinhos of Brazil. Both the, all, all four of these are numbered, of course. Nice little stack of rookies, Wales team card, and then a purple wave prism. Parallel, both numbered to 99 for Josip Stanic, Stanisic of Croatia and Ayo Tanaka of Japan. Both of those rookie cards, both of those really sharp cards indeed. So that's it, boys and girls. Happy Monday. Thanks for joining us. Happy Boxing Day. Hope you get to watch some soccer today. I will definitely be tuning in to the Premier League. Glad to have it. Much love. Many blessings. Best wishes on your collecting journey, my friends. We will see you soon.